Well, there's nothing new about women's footy, but WA's amateur ranks have received the feminine touch. Nicole Graves has become the first female to join the coaching ranks, now an A-grade assistant with the Mount Lawley Hawks. Inside runner, front and centre, long kick to the forward. Simple as that. Football's a simple game in anyone's language. Nicole Graves is walking proof. The first female to be appointed assistant coach in WA's amateur competition. For me, I hope that it breaks some barriers and that, you know, I guess someone takes the opportunity like I was given just through my sheer contacts. Right over here, Nick. Get around, boys. <laughs> Overall, really good. We got it, and I reckon you work so much better without cones, to be quite honest. With almost 200 games playing experience, Graves has an equally impressive coaching record in the women's game, recently named assistant coach of the All-Australian team. My pathway's been to the top at one side, and now I guess I'm, I'm starting again at the, uh, at the, on the other side of the game. Head coach and Sandover medalist Shane Beros headhunted the 40-year-old to help guide his charges. A switch kick to the fat side is usually not to a one-on-one -on -one contest anyway. I guess the challenge is for the boys is to, you know, hear what the words are saying rather than, you know, who's it coming from. At the first the boys were like, oh, OK, a woman, you know, like, it's different. But she's come in and just everything she says is, is great. I knew that they'd have no problem with it, you know. She'll, she'll cop a fair share, you know, but that's what footy clubs are about and, you know, and, and she'll give it back. The physicality isn't the only difference between training females and males. The biggest difference is they do what they are told, whereas women do what they're told but they want to know why. Mount Lawley are aiming to go one better this season after losing last year's A-grade grand final. Michael Genovese, 10 News.